Hi, hello, namaste, welcome back to my channel. I'm Nitya Joshi, and today is the last day of fall series. So let's start. Uh, today I am doing a yellow ochre base uh, from the fall series. So this is the last day of fall series, and I'm doing yellow ochre. I'm, I I like yellow ochre very much because I've used them in a lot of combinations. So a perfect color for the fall series. Uh, people were actually asking me like as the 100 day challenge is uh, uh, getting over like it's almost i have almost finished 3/4 of the uh, competition as i finished like 3/4 of the days like almost 75 uh, days are over people were asking me what i'm going to do later uh, i'm still going to paint i am still going to be Uh, uploading videos uh, every once in a while uh, i'm not going to obviously upload it every single day because uh, painting every day is uh, kind of strainful uh, but to be very frank i have learned a lot in this 100 days challenge than uh, the one year i have practiced because uh, if, when you take up a job every single day uh, the concentration is different the amount of uh, effort you put into it is different and uh, the execution is different so i am really happy that i planned uh, the 100 days challenge it needs a humongous amount of energy and time and uh, uh, strength to put in so much of work and so much of uh, a uh, money into this so i was a bit of i was i was really scared in the starting but i i don't know i just didn't want to give up uh, so i'm uh, there has been days when i felt like uh, uh, let me not post anything today like let me not paint anything today uh, it's been strainful today like physically some days have been strainful so let me not paint or something but i don't know something just kept me going on uh your appreciation your comments on every single day's painting has been a pure magical motivation for me to paint every single day in spite of all the obstacles so i'm very very grateful i want to go with uh, burnt sienna first because i feel like i want more of green so let me see if i can get that gold on top of it Yes, I got a lot of greens on this. So I'm very happy. Uh, some of my artist friends were actually telling me like, uh, kind of hundred days challenge is going to put you to a dead end. Where after that, uh, you're going to run out of ideas to do uh, more paintings, or you're gonna be, uh, you're gonna have a burnout, which is going to stop you from doing more paintings or exploring new things. But uh, I don't know. Uh, I I did plan the hundred days challenge in a certain way, like I wanted particular painting. So, uh, but as the time went on, uh, I I couldn't exactly do everything as I planned. So uh, some things were very spontaneous. I I would have planned something uh, on a single day, and 
that day the paint wouldn't be available or the canvas wasn't there or something went wrong with the lights or i couldn't paint or something would go wrong so uh, i i did find my way to do a painting in spite of everything so i think i still going to find a way to do paintings even after the 100 days challenge so uh, i i hope for the best and getting inspiration from things is like my main motivation in painting because uh, inspiration from something is uh, the biggest uh, uh, prop for me in painting because uh, uh that is how i push myself forward into doing a particular painting like color combinations or a painting representing something else uh that is why i go forward with uh, uh like taking motivation from things around me or from nature or from uh, an emotion or something like that so uh i'm pretty sure i'm going to be still painting uh, a year from now i am very sure so and this definitely couldn't have happened without uh, all of your support uh, constant uh, commenting or or when we met in person you used to tell me how the paintings come okay, have come out so thank you very much this painting has come out really well the cells have opened up really well i'm going to bring you down and I'm, i'll be showing you the details I hope you like today's painting please do like share and subscribe thank you for watching